Hi, this is VVD News Sports. Welcome to the first coverage of the World Cup, a transmission that we have never seen before. So, our special team is going to show us places, people and events that they have never been transmitted before. So now, we take one step to our special reporter. Anthony, are you ready? Hi Henry, we are currently in front of the Luzhniki Stadium where the entrance match will be played between Russia and Saudi Arabia. But we currently have no idea where the entrance is, so we're gonna have this guy that's just passing by. Uh, Prever! Prever! Uh, where entrance? Тебе нужно пойти сначала туда, потом налево свернешь где театр, потом нужно будет повернуться, пройти сюда, повернуться, и потом вот так, вот так, и направо. Да-да. Хочешь вот? Да. А, будешь? <laughs> well, it seems we have some technical issues. Okay. Okay. We continue with more information. The World Cup is going to take place in Russia. The dates are from June the 15th to July the 14th, we're going to have amazing games also in 12 stadiums in 11 cities on the west of the country. Oh, the master control tells me that our special guest is ready and he's back to us. Let's go with him. Yeah, exactly, Henry. We can see uh, as we are outside the stadium that the fans come here to show the supports to their favorite team by wearing their shirts. So we're gonna ask them some questions. There's a group walking just by. So, hey, what's up, guys? Hey, hey. Canadian. Do you think they're gonna win today? Yes, because we're the best. Canadian, Canadian. And uh, what's your favorite team? My favorite team is mine because we're gonna win the Stanley Cup. Yeah! Uh, they're the winner. They're gonna win. Canadia! Canadia! Mom, I love you! I'm on TV! Rihanna, I love you! She doesn't love you. So, uh, as you can see today, uh, the people are really showing the support to the team, even in the cold. Back to you in studio. Well, fans exist all over around the world. <laughs> Huh. Besides, the mascot of the 2018 Russian World Cup is going to be a wolf. His name is Zavivaka, which was elected for the vote of more than 1 million internet users with 50% of supporters. The other two proposed pets were a cat and a tiger, but the wolf won. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, Henry. We are currently in front of the stadium where the match is about to begin. This is crazy here. Everyone is there to show their support for their teams. Uh, I actually got some great news for BBD Sports. Uh, I actually got two passes from uh, FIFA himself. Uh, they granted us the access to everything. Uh, they're very important and very expensive. They, uh, <laughs> Okay, well now we're going to continue talking about fans and their benefits that they're going to get in this World Cup in Russia. FIFA is providing them with an special identification that is going to give them free entry in the Russian Federation, also free travel 
between cities and also free public transportation for them on match days. It looks really amazing, no? <laughs> Okay. Okay. Now our special reporter has some breaking news. Let's go with Anthony. Are you ready? We managed to enter the first private conference room of FIFA. We are the only media here. I repeat, we are the only media here who have access to this. Well, apparently we won't have access either. Back to you in studio. Okay, now we're going to talk about the Tesla 18. It's the name of the official ball that it was hosted by the Brazilian Brazuca in 2014. The Tesla 18 is the abbreviation of the star of the television, a name that was given in the 1970s and 1974 on the golden years of Pelé. With a predominantly white color, with black geometrical feature that give it retro feel, the Adidas Tesla 18 will have the mission to escape the criticism received by their procedures, especially for his lightness. So now we're going to go back to our special reporter, Anthony. Can you hear me? <clears throat> I don't I, I, I don't hear nothing I don't Well, our journalist Anthony is going to prepare for the next World Cup who's going to take place in Qatar. And maybe we're going to see him in 2026 in Canada. He's going to work hard. He really needs to work hard for the next World Cup. Today, Henry with you, BBD News. Good night. <laughs> Audience. 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 Audience.